I'm Richard Cree, the Editor-in-Chief of Economia, and I'm here with Stan Magatson, the um, Chief Executive Officer of the Institute of Corporate Directors. So we've just had this value of audit uh, discussion. You mentioned at that that the, the kind of role of dialogue is, is a really important part of the, of the process. The one observation I would have is that I think that actually we get the best results when we collectively discuss issues and come up with best practices and solutions. Uh, in my view, um, regulation isn't the right answer. Uh, regulation is usually uh, a result of a failure of the capital markets to find the right solution. So uh, I'm encouraged that uh, um, uh, audit firms, director community, regulators here today are talking about uh, how best to achieve audit quality in our capital markets. I'm here with Ian Bourne, Chairman of uh, SNC Leveland and uh, uh, Director and Chairman of several other companies. Do you see the future developments coming from the market, say from investors rather than from regulators? The, where it should come from is investors. I think in many cases the regulatory regime is an attempt to capture what they believe investors to be looking for and whether they always get it right or not is not completely <laughs> clear to me. Um, but I think ultimately investors are the ones who should be making the decisions and they should be driving a number of things including the regulatory regime. I'm with Glenn Fagan who's the uh, Vice President of Inspections of CFAB. Should audit quality be driven I guess by the regulators or should it be driven by the, by the firm? The only way we can regulate right now is against the uh, professional standards because that sets the baseline of quality uh, and uh, beyond that that comes, down to the, uh, that comes down to the users of the statements what they need and what they want uh, and that varies from company to company from industry to industry.